Is it running away? It's running away. Come here, you little bastard. Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Dying Light. Alright, we just got some C4 from the school that was protected by um, Ryza's men. And we're making our way back to the tower now to meet up with Jade. We'll just jump into up, up here and we'll discuss what we're going to be doing with these explosives. We know for sure that Harim wants to blow up stuff. Alright, so we're going to talk to Raheem. Whoa, the building's shaking a little bit. What is this? Alright, I think we're on the roof, aren't we? That's where we're going. Actually, guys, before we go up to the roof, I'm going to wait and quickly go to the stash, empty my stash a bit for the weapons so we can pick up more if we need to, just for backup. Alright, guys, just made a bit of space there for the, um, the inventory. Put a few stuff in the stash, a few weapons. So we've got loads of backup weapons now, so we never need to really go scavenging for that many weapons. What's Raheem up to? Crane! Saeed told me about the explosives you guys found. How perfect is that? Jade gave them to him. Saeed used to be on a bomb squad, so he knows about that stuff. Yeah, kid. That was a lucky find. Would have been better to turn up some antis in, though. My buddy Omar is making sure Saeed's putting good timers on those things. We have to be able to get our asses out of there before they blow. Whoa, we? There, there's no we in this. I, I mean, yeah, that nest needs to go, and now it's possible, but but if it gets done, I'm doing it on my own. But it's my plan. And I will execute it perfectly, I promise. But... Ah, oh, shit. There's no use arguing with you, is there? Fine. I'll contact you as soon as Saeed's finished with the charges. Raheem, do we have a deal? I guess. Do we have a deal? Yes. We have a deal. Okay, one more thing. I keep seeing this bizarre kind of infected. Is Dr. Zera out at his trailer? I'd like to talk to him about it. Nah, he's down in sickbay visiting Dr. Lena. Thanks, kid. I'll see you soon. I got a strong feeling that he's still gonna follow us anyway. Probably get himself killed. So we just ranked up our survivor skill there, so let's spend this point quickly. I'm just gonna um spend it on the haggle skill just so things cost a bit less in the stores all right so let's um, go down to the sick bay now and we'll speak to dr zero see what he says about these um green mutated zombies hey doc you got a minute oh it's uh kane yes uh, how can i help you a crane Remember when I told you about that weird infect that I saw? You know, the one who took one look at me and hauled ass away? Yeah, well, I just saw another one, and it did the same thing. Hmm. I believe I have heard your colleagues talk about those creatures. Bolters, they call them. Apparently, they favor certain areas of town over others, but only appear at night. I don't suppose you could catch one and bring me a sample of its flesh. You see, a thought occurred to me. A long shot, I realize. But if these creatures favor areas where I left my experimental bait, well, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Please do obtain a sample, but it has to be fresh. So you have to get it back to me quickly. Okay, and where exactly do I find these things? I'm told that Quartermaster chap has been keeping track of them. All right, so this is gonna be fun. It looks like we're gonna have to go out at night time. To try and catch one of these um, bolters, they call them. Alright, so we're going to speak to the quartermaster because he's got a better understanding of where they are. What can I do for you? Doc Zera says you know where I should look for these uh, bolters. Super fast infected, covered in big green blisters. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can point you in the right direction. Here, here, and here. Though you ask me, if trouble don't come looking for you, no reason to go looking for trouble. <laughs> Words to live by, thanks. So we can actually take some things off him as well. We're not going to take the police baton, because it's a crap weapon. Look at it, it's just a grey, so it's not even any good. So, sneak close to Bolter during the night and get a tissue sample. Alright, so has he marked our map? Let me just check this. There we go. What's that marker there? Bolter. Uh, stop moving. Bolter feeding. 
uh, grounds. So there's one there, there's one down here, and there's one up there. Where's the best place to go? I think we'll go for the one by the safe house, that way we can sleep there. So um, when it's night time we don't have to travel too far. There we go, it's telling us what we just done. Bolters appear at night sheet and can be found at the feeding grounds, marked on the map. If you hunt for them, be extra careful, they're easy to scare. And they run very fast. Bolters feeding grounds are usually protected by volatiles. Use firecrackers to distract them. So let's get the firecrackers um, equipped. And we'll set a waypoint on the mark on the map. And we'll go to the, the the safe house next to it. That way we'll sleep till the night. Oh, uh, we got a uh, what is this? Oh, it's a spitter. Uh! That's not the ones we're looking for, is it? The ones we're looking for only come out at night time. So, uh, oh, the safe house is the next next section. All right, here we go. It's a safe house now. How is this a safe house? Look, it's just a rooftop inside a fence. I think we can actually go inside though. Actually, <laughs> it's not really inside. It's just underneath a roof. So this is the safe house apparently. We're gonna sleep here till night time, and we'll head towards that um, feeding zone. All right, it's dark now. So let's. It's just north of us here. It's just just out, outside the door really. So as long as we get firecrackers out, we'll distract them. I think we've got to kill it, haven't we, to get the sample? And bring it to the dock there quickly afterwards, so it's, well, it's still fresh. So I think there's one right there. Go away! Firecrackers, firecrackers, firecrackers. I think that's it there. Is it running away? It's running away! <laughs> Come here, you little bastard. Oh my god, this guy's fast, isn't he? I think I might have scared him away actually by accident. I shouldn't have done that. Where is he? There he is, there he is, there he is. Should I get the gun out? Might not be a bad shout to get the gun out, you know. Let's get the gun out. Fuck. He jumped on me there, didn't he? I think he's dead. We got the tissue. We got the tissue. Right now, this, oh my god, this is this is crazy. Make our way to the safe zone. Well, well, I think we have to actually have to get to the doctor, don't we? Quickly before it goes all rotted. So I think we might just run for it because if we wait till the morning. It's like ten hours. So let's just make a run for it. Let's heal as well quickly, just so we're at full health. So less chance of dying. I'm just going to run for the objective. So let's just hope our stamina doesn't run too low and we start panting. Let's get the weapon out. Don't want to make any more noise with the gun, do we? I'm surprised how quick that thing died, though. I shot it in the back like one or two bullets. And it just dropped. Our agility's increased there. So you do get double points for playing at night time as well, which is pretty good. You know what, this, it's, this game just becomes like ten times scarier when you play at night time. Alright, here we go, we made it. Nice. Knock knock. Ah, uh, Crane, come in, come in. Did you get the samples I asked for? Excellent, excellent. I was just telling Dr. Camden about Hello, you. Hello, Mr. Crane. Glad to have you working with us. You uh, sound like an impressive individual. Interesting stuff what passes for blood in this creature. Photosensitive. Quite deadly if used on a weapon, I'd wager. But I digress. My last bit of reagent here, and a reserve vial of... Oh, my word. This tissue, it's testing positive for the recombined virus. Camden, do you know what this means? The meat experiment worked. When I dose the meat samples with the altered strain, it's had an effect. This could explain all the different mutations. But I can't. Camden could. He has the equipment. But we have no way to get the research to him. Well, you can talk to him on the radio. Why not share the info that way? Water, water everywhere, and not a drop to drink. 
What if I delivered this stuff to you, Dr. Camden? By hand. The data and the tissue samples both. Crane, getting from there to here would be insanely dangerous. Yeah, but it could mean a cure, right? You don't know how much this means, dear boy. To me, to all of us. I'll contact you when everything's ready. You must go now. Much to do. Much to do. Alright, so that was pretty chaotic right then. Hey, Crane, you there? Omar and I went to blow up that nest. What? Wait, you what? Fucking hell, Rahim, that was my job! Oh, right, because you're more qualified to handle explosives than I am. You're just a goddamn tourist! But listen, we messed up. Messed up bad. Alright, what happened? Where are you? We're on the overpass, and it's all going to shit. Listen, head to the train yard. Find a place to hide. I'm on my way. Oh my, behind you! Behind you! Raheem! Raheem! God damn it. Okay, um, hopefully they can wait for like 10 Reckon. hours. Because I'm gonna sleep. Copy. Yeah, I copy. What is it? I'm on my way to get Raheem. Raheem? He's here in the tower. No, he's not. He and Omar want to blow that nest, and now they're in trouble. It's like, what? Fuck! Where'd they get the explosives? Well, I... Look, I stole them from Rise. Oh, Jesus, H. Christ! I'm close. I'll get him to safety, Brecken. You damn well better. You save him, you hear me? You save him so I can kick his fucking ass! Does Jade know about this? No, she doesn't. For God's sake, don't tell her. She'll go out looking for him, and I don't need her getting herself killed too. God damn it! All right, so like I said just then, I'm gonna hopefully try and sleep, and hopefully uh, Raheem won't die because <laughs> we we've waited like ten hours. So because uh, I didn't want to make my way over there in the night time, you know, and then get there and have to deal with helping him in the dark, so it'd just be a massive amount of craziness. So we'll make our way over there in the daytime when it's a lot safer. All right, making our way to the round to the. Um, the start of the overpass so we can actually get onto it on top of it so we'll jump on here and we're looking for him anywhere up here i think he's just hiding zombies get wrecked so there's quite a lot of zombies around here try and run past the majority of them don't want to break our weapon too quick i'm hearing a lot of screaming behind me there's nothing there. They're okay. Oh shit. This is not good. Who's this? Raheem, where the hell are you? Brecken, it's me. I found Omar's body on the overpass, but no trace of Raheem. Shit. Any idea where he'd go? I told him to hide in the train yard. You find him. You hear me? That little bastard better be alive. <laughs> he just wants to kick his ass, doesn't he? How old is Raheem? I think he's like he's young adult and he's like 18 maybe. 20, 20 at the oldest, I think. So Omar's dead. I don't know who Omar was. I think he was just the guy from the tower. So this is the building Raheem's supposed to be inside. Let's go up the stairs. Um, okay, actually, wait, no, we need to go inside. Downstairs, apparently, according to the map, here's a doorway here. That's right! Keep coming, you motherfuckers! I'll send you all to hell! So it looks like we're heems inside this train car. We have to clear the way outside. Just um, take our time taking these zombies out. I don't know if that double whammy right there. Let's get some stamina back. Try and loot these corpses as well, because you can get metal parts from these as well as cash. And it's pretty good for um, repairing weapons. Oh my god, that hits me! Shit! <laughs> Self harming. Right, let's loot a few of these zombies. There's metal parts, they're good. 
We've got loads of metal parts though, actually. We've got 40 now. <laughs> we can repair 40 times. Let's open this car. Not one of these again. I think we'll just jump up there and take him out with the we melee weapon. Just hack him down. There we go. It's not that difficult to kill, really. Just like any other zombie, but he does more damage. He's ranged. So let's get Raheem out. Raheem! Crane, I didn't think I'd make it, so I armed the bombs. They'll blow in less than five minutes. You idiot. Oh shit, kid, you're bleeding. Huh? Oh, I, I cut myself. It's nothing. Fuck, just, just plant the bombs. I right, don't move. You got it? I'll, I'll be right back. What is this guy's problem? Raheem, can you hear me? Where the fuck am I going with these things? There's a sewer entrance here in the terminal, near the west wall. Use that tunnel. It'll take you straight to the hive. So, we're going to the west wall, he said. Oh god, just water down here. Um, yeah. Okay, so we need to go through this sewer. Is this the actual nest right now? Or are we just going this way to get closer to where we need to be? We've only got three minutes to do this, so we've got to be quick. Can't really t stop around, hang around and fight many zombies. I mean, I'm going to expect there's going to be loads of zombies in here because it is the nest. Okay, I'm back on the surface. See that big ass culvert over there, right? Head through it. Once you get into the building, head up the ramp and get up to the floor above. You need, you need to put the bomb on one of the big storage cars. <laughs> Right, this is this the nest right now, I think. There's quite a few bodies around, like just piles of guts and shit, move of the way. Okay, just, we're just gonna make a run for it, I think. We don't need to hang around and kill zombies, do we? Because we're gonna. Okay, first one set. Okay. Pay attention. Find some stairs. Get to the next floor up. You're looking for another column. Okay, these are stairs. <laughs> Alright, looking for another column up the stairs, so we can't up the stairs. Where can we go? Oh shit, what's this? Let's take the stuff. Oh, it's empty. Okay, um, let's go this way. We've only got two minutes left now. Can we get through these? It, look, it looks like it's blocked. Um, there's a gap doorway over there. Just be quick. Just keep moving. Here's the pillar. Alright, got it. Stuck. I'm stuck on the corner. Heal, heal, heal. Okay, we need to get out of here. I think we need to go for the wall where that big guy came through. Let's try and run around them all. Alright, we can drop down here. Oh, this guy looks scary, doesn't he? Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, we just dropped. We just made a noise there by jumping on the broken wood. Draw more attention. Alright, go for this KCM tube. Is it blown up? Holy shit. Okay, we need to go down the hole. It worked, man. Go, go, go. Hey, your plan worked, kid. Raheem? Hey, do you copy? Shit. Looks like the water's flooding up as well. Right, I need to get through here quickly before we drown. I'm stuck on a fence. Uh, we haven't got... We just need to... I think this is the way we came in as well. I think we took quite a bit of damage then as well from the explosion. The tower seemed to fall on us. Let's hope Raheem's okay. Let's heal up. Right, he was in here, wasn't he? Come on. Raheem! Hey, it's me, kid! I did it! Ah, oh, Raheem! Oh, you should have seen it! Oh, God. The whole damn building came down! Oh shit! Oh, no, 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 Raheem, stop! Raheem, it's me! It's me, kid, it's Crane! Oh, Jesus! Raheem, stop! So oh. 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 
fucking bite wound? You goddamn stupid fucking kid! Oh god, Jade. Crane, do you copy? What's going on? Bracken. Raheem. Raheem's dead. Fuck. Get back here. Don't say a word to Jade. Not yet. So he told us that he cut himself, didn't he? When in fact he was bitten. Stupid shit. Alright, so we're going to make our way back to the tower now. We'll speak to Ian Brecken. And see what we're going to do about telling Jade the bad news. Alright, so we've arrived at the um, the tower. Let's go, let's go speak to Brecken. Hopefully, the hopefully we don't jump bump into Jade before we see Brecken though. All right, so I just automatically went up the elevator to try and find Brecken. It turns out he's not even up there. He is here. Brecken, how did he die? I had to kill him. It was too late. He, he turned. I had no choice, I swear. Look, look he was my friend, too. He's the best one I had here. I know, I know. He frustrated the shit out of me sometimes. I loved him like he was my own kin. Another dead friend. Another dead brother. I trusted him. I trusted him with those explosives. God, maybe if I didn't leave him there, he'd... He'd still be alive. I... I'd... Oh, no. Jade! Jade! Wait! Jade, God damn it! Just, just give her time. She needs to grieve. Sarah! Shit! Get down there! We can't let them take you! So Zer is under attack. Is it in Rise's men? I'm thinking it might be. I don't want to fall down there too high. Okay, we need to get there. 20, 28 seconds. The zombie in my face. Keep moving, keep moving. <laughs> oh, they got guns. Oh, I just L2 to aim and I threw a firecracker. The fire rate, the frame rate tends to shit when there's fire everywhere. Give me your gun. Okay, so we defended the place. Looks like there's going to be some zombies coming though, so we'll switch to this. See if the doctor's okay. There's no one inside. They took Zera and drove away. Night is coming. Shit. Shit. Brecken. Zera's been kidnapped. His trailer's on fire. God damn it! You see what happens when you fuck with Rice? You should never have hit that school. Some of our people spotted a big knot of bandits heading back to Rice's garrison. That's gotta be where they took Zera. You go there and you find him and you bring him back alive. You hear me? Alright guys, we're gonna go inside now and um, get some sleep, wait for the morning, and we'll go out and we'll find Zay in the next video. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!